if you're not getting the full internet speed that you're paying for from your Asus X55 Wi-Fi router, you get laggy, unstable or slow internet speed on wired or Wi-Fi network, then in this beginner's guide I'll show you the most useful ways to easily fix slow network issues on your Asus X55 router. The most common thing that is often overlooked is the positioning of your router. If your router is too far away, then all the devices won't get proper coverage. So put your Wi-Fi in a place where all the devices are near your router. And the reason why your router may be disconnecting, slow or laggy is because of unproper wire connections. So check if the Ethernet cables are plugged in properly and they're not old or damaged. If you're using a very old Ethernet cable, then it is highly recommended that you upgrade to CAT6 or CAT7 Ethernet cables. Even after following this, if you're getting slow internet or Wi-Fi issues, then you can try resetting both your router and your modem. Simply unplug them from power source and wait for around 5 minutes. Then plug them back in and your network should be refreshed. Now if these beginner steps didn't work for you, then we'll move to more advanced ones. First, make sure that you're connected to your router's Wi-Fi, you can use a computer or a mobile device, and we're skipping the app because it doesn't have all the settings. So go ahead and open your browser, go to asusrouter.com and log in. First, we'll check for our router's firmware update. If it's not up to date, then update it first, and your network issues should be fixed. If it doesn't and you're still getting slow internet speed, then let's see how you can speed it up easily by changing the DNS server. To change DNS, from the left panel, go to WAN and then under WAN DNS settings, click on Assign. By default, it will be your ISP's automatic DNS server, but we'll switch to a faster DNS server. And as you can see, Google is already added here, so we can switch to Google right away. Or you can also add another fast DNS server by going down to manual setting. We're going to stick with Google and hit Save. Just changing these DNS settings should increase your internet speed drastically. But if you're still facing slow internet issues, then we'll move to the next step, which is changing the bandwidth of your router. For that, we need to go to wireless. Now select 5 GHz or 2.4 GHz band. We are going to first go with 5 GHz. And from here, go to channel bandwidth. And in case you're living in a congested area with a lot of routers and electronic devices, then select channel bandwidth to either 20 MHz or 40 MHz. This will decrease the network interference and your network will become more stable. From here we can change another settings that's right below it called control channel. And if we tap on it, this will allow us to choose a clean channel for a Wi-Fi router. And to choose which one is the best, we'll use a Wi-Fi analyzer app that you can download easily from Google Play Store or Apple's App Store. We're going to use our Android device, so let's search for Wi-Fi analyzer, then install and open one. If it asks for location permission, then you need to allow it. And then from the top, choose 2.4G or 5G. And now you'll be able to see which channels are most congested. And we can see here channel 1 to channel 10 is most populated. So we can use channel 12 to 13 or 14 for the most stable Wi-Fi. Now we'll switch to 5G. And as you can see here, channel 149 and 165 is being used by all the nearby routers. So we're going to go back to your laptops and put in these channels for each of the bands. After that, scroll down and apply. And now your Wi-Fi networks will be more stable and you can enjoy the internet uninterrupted. If you still think there's room for improvement, then you can set up QoS to prioritize your most important devices. And we have a separate video about that, so you're welcome to watch it here. And that's all. If this was helpful, make sure to let us know and stick around for more.